In here, I've got a pair of Scott Shield sunglasses. I impulsively bought these for 30 of the Kins English pounds because they have an RRP of 99.99 and I thought that was exceptionally good value. As I seem to have an increasing number of blue kit options, I went for the Submariner blue colorway. Uh, so, so let's open them. Uh, got here, we've got a hard case. It's always good. Always good to have a hard case. User manual for eyewear. Hmm. Uh, in the hard case, you've got the standard soft pouch, which doubles as your cleaning cloth. There's no, no extra nose piece, though, which is a bit disappointing. Anyway, here they are. There you go, look at those. Pretty, pretty cool. Pretty nice. So as mentioned, it's the Submariner Blue colorway with the gold lenses. The gold lenses are supposed to be good for slightly cloudier days, apparently. They increase contrast and give a greater depth perception and more clarity. So they're always popular with sports people, gold lenses. They're pretty good. I am disappointed about the no spare nose piece, though. They seem to sit pretty well, but let's put them on the scales. I've been very impressed with these glasses so far. The field of vision is great. There's nothing blocking your eyes at all. Uh, they sit really well on my nose, which considering I've broken my nose several times and it's all over the place, is quite a good thing and quite unusual for uh, sunglasses and me. And the other thing that I found unusual, which is really good, is that they sit really well in the vents of my met with our helmet, which I can't say the same for a lot of other glasses. They're really good in sunlight and really actually pretty good in shadows and in, in all but the, the darkest shadows. So performance wise, I can't really fault them. And for 30 quid, absolute bargain.